everyone, it's Yvette. So I wanted to come on here and wish you all a very Merry Christmas, just in case I didn't get to see you guys before then. And I didn't want to forget to tell you all. So I hope you have a very blessed one and I hope you guys get lots of goodies. So I wanted to come on here and do a quick video because I got a couple things this weekend that I really wanted to share with you. And I have to thank one of my good subscribers, Tracy. She is amazing. She told me that Costco has these amazing leggings right now. And it was pretty convenient because I was going to be heading to Costco anyways. So the first place I went was, you know, the clothing section. And they were all folded. Um, and I believe they were $14.99. But they also came in like an army color green which all they had was extra small and I, there's I don't think I could fit in those ones and then they also had navy and then the gray a uh, black and the faux leather so let me show you guys the first pair I picked up and these are the faux leather ones now I wouldn't I mean I don't know if I would call it a faux leather it almost feels like it has a coating on here it's really really nice like it's not the kind where I feel like it's gonna crack and whatnot but it almost feels like full leather but then again I think it's just a really thick coating and they're really really warm I had them on last night I didn't want to take them off and then this side does not have it and this side does so if you guys can see but I did pick up a small now they're by the brand Maddie M and they're really really cute so I do want to mention this, um, I tried the black ones on, not the black ones, the gray ones on, and the, the waistband on those didn't stretch at all, but these ones gave just a little bit, so I, I almost, I think, could have gotten an extra small in these, almost, but I'm scared that the extra small might be too tight on my legs, so I mean, the... The looser waistband doesn't really bother me, but, you know, it makes you feel like maybe you could have sized down, but I'm a little bit nervous too. And here are the gray ones, and this is like the perfect color gray. So this is what the gray ones look like, and they go all the way down to your ankle. They grab you in all the right places. They are not see-through. They are nice and thick, and they're just awesome so i really like them so this one i did get a size small as well but like i said the the waistband on this doesn't i think it's because that coating is not on there so i don't know i still love them i'm gonna be wearing the full leather ones today so i'm really really excited okay and then i got a shirt from i ordered it off hyperline and i've never ordered anything off that website yet and I saw that they had a bunch of, you know, shirts on sale. And I was like, okay, I'm just going to check them out. And I'm on a mission just for, like, simple, basic tees, but not, like, just t-shirts. Like, flowy shirts. And I just, I'm switching up my wardrobe, so I'm on the hunt for new things. But I saw that they had this shirt um, on sale. And it's by the brand Monroe. And it looks like this. This is what I had on Friday in my outfit of the day. I had my moto jacket on and then this shirt. And I think the color of this is called graphite, which I thought it was going to be a black, but it's almost like a navy, like a dark navy gray, I mean, charcoal. Charcoal is like the perfect word for it. So it's um, also, well, I think it was called the Jersey, the Monroe Jersey it is a little bit on the thin side but I really really like it and originally it was like seventy some dollars and it was on sale for like 38 and then I saw on the top of the web page if I typed in the word holiday certain things qualified for 30% off so I was like what the heck I'm gonna try it and it qualified so I only paid like 26 for it and then plus tax and it was free shipping so I paid 20 eight dollars i think for this so that was a good deal and then i ran to ulta um i mean this isn't going to be like a, a super long video or anything but i just ran to ulta with my friend ashley the other night after i got done baking all those cookies speaking of cookies i need to head to the post office and ship a bunch of them out i gotta go 
picked job sites and you know passed them out and whatnot so I got to go do that today but once I got done being a Betty Crocker I went to Ulta with my friend Ashley and I needed to get some essentials if you guys watch my empties I was like out of a lot of things and I needed some more dry shampoo I was completely out and Ashley was telling me that she really likes this one this is the rich and elegant paisley and then I wanted to finally pick up the sassy and daring wild the one in the cheetah print because they're always out of this one and I wanted to try it but Ashley said that this one smells really good and I use this one today and it does smell really good so I picked those up and I had you know 20% off my entire purchase so I had to use that <laughs> okay and I picked up something for Sarah which I need to put in her in her box to ship out and I ran out of my deep conditioner so I needed to pick up a, another one so this time I bought the it's a 10 one this is the one I use for years and years but I'm kind of you know just switching things up and I just don't want my hair to get used to like the same deep conditioner so I think it's good to to switch things up and okay so then I picked up the physician's formula eye booster or the two-in-one pen that I use every single day and Lisa really inspired me to try a brown eyeliner but I was looking for my ultra black and Ulta was out of my ultra black liner and when I saw that they had a deep brown one I was like you know I'm gonna try this and I really want to do a winged out brown liner and see what that looks like so hopefully tomorrow I'll try this one out so I got that and then I needed some more eyelashes so I picked up the Ardell 120 Demis these are just my favorite I really love them obviously I was desperate because I had to use a pair already so I got those and you guys know that I've been picking up the small bottles of the style sexy hair and they didn't have any of those little stocking stuffers so I had to pick up the full size one it was just cheaper if I picked up four of the small ones versus the one big one but whatever I didn't really have a choice so I picked up the the big can of it and this is a spray clay one shine seven hold texturizing spray clay and I just spray it in my hair and it kind of gives you some hold but it gives you like some separation too and I I seriously can't live without that stuff and on days where I don't want to put dry shampoo um, in my roots like especially when my hair has like you know I got my roots and it's grown out it works so good as like a volume booster I spray it in like a dry shampoo and then I tease my hair and it's big <laughs> so I really have been loving that stuff okay and then the last thing I picked up is something I'm not a huge fan of and I walked by the new Gwen Stefani holiday nail polishes by OPI and I saw this one and I completely fell in love with the color and it's called in a holidays and it is just a super gorgeous cranberry color but and that's what I have on today however the formula is so thin that I cannot get over I had to use three coats with this I mean it, and to me I don't mind doing three coats but by the time I do a third coat I feel like my nails don't don't they don't turn out the same and I don't know if it I just I don't know I don't like it I really don't so I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this one back but I'm just beautiful color I love it but I do not like the formula so and if I'm not gonna use it it's definitely not worth to keep so that's what I got and I just really wanted to show you guys my leggings that I found because they are so amazing so Tracy thank you thank you thank you I am obsessed so I'm gonna go put this on and I'm really late for work so I really better get going so I hope you guys have a very Merry Christmas and a wonderful day and I will talk to you guys really soon bye